Hey guys, how are you? I hope you all are doing good and it's Fahad from WordPoint.com and today I am back with another amazing custom ROM for our Redmi Note 10 Pro users and this time this is the Bliss OS and I am uh, reviewing the Bliss OS after a very long time so let me show you its details it is the Bliss OS 16.3 and it is the Typhoon build and it is based on the Android 13 as you can see here and its security patch is also all the way latest 5 January 2023. So the ROM is pretty much stable. In this video, I will be showing you its full review, what customizations and features we have in this ROM, and I will also tell you how you can install it on your Redmi Note 10 Pro. And uh, that's it. Without any further ado, let's get started. Before starting the video, make sure to subscribe my channel and also press the bell icon for the future updates. So first of all let's start from the performance. The performance of this ROM is pretty much cool. As you can see here everything is just opening pretty much quickly. There is no any single bug or issue. This ROM is completely lag free. And if you talk about the applications here we have about bliss right here. From here you can check the home, you can also check the supported devices. And because this is an official update so you can check the devices right from here. By the way official and unofficial both builds are available for our redmi note 10 pro i will drop the uh, download links of both builds in the description box then we have the team and other options then we have camera right here and in the camera here we have a pretty much simple camera pre-installed i don't know why they are not putting an anx or the cam or me camera in the custom rooms but still if you want more features then you can go for a Google camera mode from the google.com then we have Dolby Atmos right here which can be in used to get more sound quality FM radio is uh, present right here then we have this uh, phonograph plus which is available so if we talk about the home screen here we have home launcher and here we have some settings like you can enable some quick actions for the uh, recents and they will be shown right at the bottom and you can also check the memory status right here and uh, from the left you can access the google now you can add widgets or wallpapers to customize your home screen by the way this wallpaper is pre-installed in this rom so you can enable dark theme themed icons custom themed icons you can change the upgrade you can change system icon pack and you can also change the system phones right from here then you can add a lot of widgets to customize your home screen like I did. Now let's go into the settings and have a look on the customizations. And the quick settings looks like this. So you can simply edit it out. Uh, you can add a lot of shortcuts to your quick settings. And in the settings here we have connectivity options, apps, Blissify. And in the Blissify here we have all available customizations. First of all let's start from the animations. From here you can uh, use any animation like 3D menu animation fly let's try 3d 3d looks like this and all other animations then we have button settings then we have gestures here we have system gestures the system gestures here we have swap three finger for screenshot quickly open camera system navigation bar one-handed mode you can simply operate the uh, phone by using one uh, by using only one hand then we have press and hold power button prevent ringing smart pause then we have a uh, tap to wake and tap to sleep options then we have lock screen notifications and here we have in call vibrations then we have uh, power menu right here you can also enable the advanced reboot and you can also enable a lot of shortcuts to it as you can see here so after it here we have quick settings then we have status bar you can simply change the battery style battery percentage uh, QS battery style you can also manage the f uh, icons, status bar icon manager. Then we have themes. In the themes, you can change the phone style. You can change icon style, signal icon style, Wi Fi icon style, icon style, and you can also use the black theme. And in the MISC, here we have USB configurations, wake on plug, ignore window, square flags. We don't have uh, any option to unlock the higher FPS in games in this room and we don't have uh, any option to unlock the unlimited photo storage so that's a negative point for this room then we have notifications battery 
and the battery performance of this ROM as usual it is pretty much good as you can see here then we have battery saver we also have the extreme battery saver then we have battery manager then we have sound and vibration and in the sound and vibration here we have haptic feedback we also have the main sound enhancer which will be helpful to enhance the sounding quality and we also have the Dolby Atmos at the same time so then we have display in the display we have all same options like previous ROMs then we have uh, you can uh, you can set up the refresh rate right from here you can set up minimum or maximum or preferred refresh rate right from here to 60 hertz or 120 hertz that's a plus point and you can also hide the applications by using this feature no need to download any third party application then we have accessibility security in the security all security options are available right here as you can see here face unlock and fingerprint is also available to use you can simply register your face and use at the same time then we have privacy location safety emergency password digital well-being is right here google system in the system we have languages and input live translate thermal profiles data and time backup bliss updater rules multiple user reset option and a lot of features are missing in this ROM if we compare it to the previous ROMs. In the previous ROMs, we have uh, more features than this. But still, this is a, a reliable source and you can use it as your daily driver too. There is no any single bug or issue in this ROM. Everything is just working fine. It is based on Android 13. Bliss OS version is 13.3. Uh, sorry, 16.3. And its uh, security patch is also on the way latest. So if you want to install this ROM, you can check the instructions right on your screen. The download link for the official and unofficial build is available in the description box. You can go and download it. And uh, this was the video for Bliss OS for our Redmi Note 10 Pro. So hope you guys like this video. If you really did, hit the like button. And if you have any question or queries about this video, then you can let us know in the comment second section. And you can also ask us on the telegram telegram group and channel link is in the description box you can also subscribe to my second channel where i used to post custom rom review videos like this so you can find all the links in the description box keep supporting thanks for watching peace